Hello everyone, I am the Abysmal Kraken and welcome to my tutorial on finding all the golden obelisks in Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. After receiving the Rosetta Stone from the archaeologist in the Bedouin outpost, you are able to translate the writing on the golden obelisks. He asks you to translate the writing on all five of them before returning to him, but where are the obelisks? The first of the three obelisks are close to the Bedouin outpost. Head past the healer's tent and you should immediately see the first obelisk. Then head along the cliff past the lost temple of Heliopolis and you'll see another obelisk at the top of the cliff overlooking South Beach. Continuing to the right, you'll find some hanging targets guarded by a half brute. To get to the third obelisk, run over to the Atun disc nearby and use the speed boost to jump and hit the targets in quick succession. The pillar will raise and you'll be able to reach the obelisk. While you're on this ledge, you can also open the chest to get a key, which opens the gate to the Great Obelisk. To get to the fourth obelisk, run towards the passage leading to Heliopolis Point and Great Wall Entrance 3. As you go through, you should spot it on a ledge to your right. Read the text, then continue round and go towards Great Wall Entrance 2 and the Cursed Palace, where the Broken Eye of Ra posts are. Climb the rope to your left and you'll see the final obelisk. After reading the final translation, you can run back to the archaeologist who will give you the Hathor statue. From here, you can unlock the gate with the key you picked up earlier and place the statue on the pedestal by the Great Obelisk. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, and if you have, please consider subscribing to my channel and giving the video a like. Also, feel free to leave a comment with any suggestions for future videos, or come and chat with me over on Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the abysmal kraken. I'm the abysmal kraken. Thanks for watching.